there is no guilt because you know what? It is football season, and the kickoff to the football season has begun with all of those preseason parties. Jeff, first, ladies and gentlemen, from Beef O Brady's is here with tailgating tips to score big at your next party. You've already scored big with us here on The Blend. We got an amazing spread for you guys today. This is an exciting time for Beef O'Brady's. We've got football season is in full swing. I mean, heck, we got college season right around the corner. High school football. There's fantasy football going on right now as well, too. So there is so many different reasons to indulge in all of the different food items that we've got here. Are wings the number one tailgating food? Tailgate food? Tailgate food? By far and away, yeah. I believe they would yeah. be. Yes, and I would, I, would go, I would go a step further and say perhaps, even though these all look great, I, I would go if you're tailgating because, you know, you don't always have napkins out when you're tailgating. Go with something that's a little less saucy. I say boneless, that as far as the less messy option, that's yeah. why our boneless wings have gained popularity. But we've also got right now, so we've got 12 different flavors as far as actual sauce flavors. Wow. we got three dry flavors as you well. You have a dozen dry sauce rice. flavors? We have a dozen, and, we, wow. and every year we come out with more. So you're going to see, uh, you know, make sure you check back with us because we'll have a new sauce for you. But the dry rubs, like you were saying, the dry rubs, very popular now as well, too. This is our Nashville dry rub, but we actually do a lemon pepper and a blackened as well, too. So oh those are, it's an amazing option as well, too. So. I'll say my husband is all about the dry rub. He's all about the dry rub wings. Okay, but that's not all. You know, of course you say that that's in the number one seller, but we do have some interesting, uh, this is what's got, caught my eye here. Explain. It's a Absolutely. little twist on something a little more sophisticated, it's, right? Hey, you know what? You want to you want to bring something a little different to the party and, and get recognized quickly, and I promise you, you'll probably be unique and the only person that brought it. Then you need to bring yourself some fried raviolis. Oh, man. So fried ravioli, this is on our new, we've got our two for 20 menu that we're kicking off again on the 26th. So this Monday, we're going to be kicking that off. Um, we've got the raviolis. They come with the marinara sauce in the middle, but then um, uh, above and beyond that, we've also got those potato wedges in the middle as well, too. The so. great thing about fried ravioli is if you don't have any sauce it's really not a problem no absolutely you know, not. They, they, they they taste pretty I'm darn the, good I'm, I'm, I'm trying to find out here i don't know if we actually i stole i'm glad i stole one off the one that we were not taking a close-up of but uh, i'm liking this I, i'm i'm set i am set on this front Be beevil brady's is what is a restaurant where you walk into it and you look at the menu and you want to order everything mm -hmm. And it's the the only the only downside is when you get full you can't have well I had the I had these wings but I wanted to have that burger and some queso and y you know what I mean absolutely you just, there's just not enough room I don't think anybody has enough room to eat all the wonderful stuff at Beefle Brady. Hey, you know what? You bring it home with you. Who doesn't have an air fryer at home anymore? <laughs> so bring it home and you've got you've, you've got the next day covered. Well, and that was a perfect segue to talking about all the choices at Beefo Brady's. That's where you guys can help tailgate parties Absolutely. and people can have their choice. Yeah. Explain what all this is about. Well, I mean, as far as tailgate parties, this is, uh, you've got catering uh, amounts that you can order any of these items in. So as far as, as far as bringing wings, as far as bringing boneless, um, you know, we can do them in any size, any denominations that you're looking for. So, you know, uh, what better than to, than to bring a pan of those with you to whatever party you're going to and whatever tailgate you're going to. And it's not just the fun food or what my uh, nine-year-old calls easy food, like burgers and wings. You guys easy also food. have almost, uh, what, 10 salads. You've got zucchini, you've got broccoli, you, you have the, the lighter side or the... Uh, the, the healthier side uh, as well. You got it all. Absolutely. We were talking earlier about the rice bowls that we feature now. That's one of our most popular items. We have lettuce wraps now as well, too. So if you're looking for something, you know, definitely more healthy than you've got a, you know, what's better than a romaine wrap with, you know, with some grilled chicken in it. So, well, in my opinion, you know, there's other things that are better. Speaking of your burgers, too, I think we're going to assemble one here real quickly, right? Yeah, we had, uh, we've, we've got them pretty much put together already, but we were just going to go ahead and show some light assembly on this as well, too. And now you guys use, uh, is it ground chuck? This is going to be all uh, Angus beef that well, we've Angus got. Beef, okay. Absolutely. So I'm going to do two of them next to each other just so we can knock them out real. And we've got our fire, our Amarillo firecracker burger, and we've got our barbecue Ooh. bacon cheeseburger. So okay. what's great and about is this, these? Is this easy food, Jerome? Is Raquel would say oh, easy food? Oh yeah, food? this is I very like that. easy. Food. I'm going to hold. I like that term. Yeah, easy food. Yeah, vegetables for her. Not not always easy. Not food. easy food. No. I, I Raquel and I have the same palate. I think. <laughs> I think you do. I well, think you got... do. Now the onion rings uh, are on which one? So on the onion rings here, we've got our barbecue bacon cheeseburger. So we're going to go ahead and we'll put a little barbecue sauce on there as oh, well too, man. just to dress Could that up. Put some of that right into my mouth. <laughs> oh, and then we've got our sweet jalapeno aioli for the 
Amarillo Firecracker Burger. See, okay, here's the thing. You, I look at both of these. I want to press both of them together and eat them as one giant sandwich. <laughs> I'm sure we could pull it off for you. If you really <laughs> wanted to do that, we'll make it happen. Okay. And so we've got the lettuce and tomatoes on top of that one. Sure. And we'll go ahead and keep that lid on there. Burger and okay. Look you at that. Are ready to go. Nice. Well, let's talk yes, location so people can indulge. Of course, I always feel bad because we're talking about the great food here. How can people at home have fun with you guys this football season? We're, what are locations these hey, days? Go to b 4 um, You know, you can find all of the area locations. Um, I'm partial. I've, I've actually have, I own part of the one out in Valrico. So if you want to Valrico, come <laughs> There you go. Me. But um, we've got uh, we got plenty of area locations. It's uh, uh, one of them, 2819 South McDill Avenue. We got 2210 South Himes Avenue. We got 15784 Northdale Mabry. Um, right, in, uh, right in you guys' backyards. There's one on every street corner, practically. There and you if go. you go in, you might be able to talk the staff there to turn in on some sports to watch while you're there. Maybe. Maybe one up. or two TVs, <laughs> right? right? Hey, good seeing you again. Thanks for being here today. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.